method. We're just, All right. We, okay. We start the pod where we clap because we've been talking so much shit beforehand. <laughs> and Jart always does something very naughty, don't you? Well, I do, I do don't I? And very I'm, naughty, aren't you? And chill. Who's the naughtiest little senorita in here? Me. Tess. Well, you, you, you're also a bit of a naughty senorita. Mm, well, I just figured out that the bloody George Foreman grill was named after a boxer. George Foreman? Yeah. It's fucking wild, isn't it? And genius marketing from him. That the George Foreman grill was just a bloody toaster, which drizzled out some some juice. Yeah. Some fat. Yeah. That's he he, he knew how to milk the fat f- from the buyers. It's excellent. I'm I'm working off two hours sleep. That was shocking. I I should technically laugh at everything because I'm delirious and tired. Well, run me through what run judge, me through what that joke means. Judge, humor is subjective. Correct. Now if someone learnt a new word. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> I'm very clever, aren't I? <laughs> yeah, you are. Uh, okay, let's <sighs> let's let's jump into you, champion. This is a this is a therapy session. Okay. What's you just got back from Thailand. Correct. Or was it Bangkok? Well, that's both correct. Oh, okay. yeah. I'm so sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Both are right. Mm. Bangkok is in Thailand. I did know that. Sorry. So I had a thing with Call of Duty. Mm-hmm. Go over there. Anyway, that'll do. I'll fucking. You know my favourite part about the trip away. What? Last week you were going. Nah, it'll be epic because, like, I'll go do the Call of Duty thing. I have a weekend off. It'll be fucking chill. I get this video from you last night in a tuk tuk. <laughs> Like, whoa, look at this bus. Oh, my God. I was, I was like, so great. Drunk. You, know who's, <laughs> you know who's keeping the podcast afloat tomorrow? The Big uh, Dog LDD. LDD. And yeah. you know who Big Dog LDD is? Yeah, mummy. Mummy. Yeah, your mummy, by, by the way. Yeah, mama's going to have to run the show here. Mm. Well, it's what I'm used to, Josh. <laughs> <laughs> Jake. Yeah, look. You, you got... Blind last night, not last night, the night before. Fucking blind, like. And then you're not a good sleeper on planes. So I've had two hours. So I've done. So I left on Saturday. <clears throat> I left on Saturday. Had a wedding in Scone. Shout out to Big Les and the crew for this fucking mad wedding in Scone. But I couldn't really grog on. Why is it um, pronounced Scone when it's written Scone? So I had a wedding in Scone. Okay, uh, we'll just and just I, jump over that. Part. <laughs> <laughs> I um. I left at about 9.30-ish, probably got into fucking Sydney at one thirty odd You're just and outrageous. And then I had to pack. I had to pack my clothes, so I packed. Probably got to sleep at like 2-ish, back up at 6 to the airport, flight to Thailand Saturday. Didn't go out the first night, I literally got in, had a shower, went to sleep in the hotel. Woke up the next morning, had the show, so it was like a Call of Duty live stream. Mm. So there was two two mobs doing it, like the Aussie mob and then the Japanese mob. Mm. So we did the live stream. It was like two hours where we could just yarned about Call of Duty then played, streamed it live you're while you're little, smoking. You're a little geek, aren't you? Yeah, I am. Mm. I'm a geek at heart. Met some really cool motherfuckers there too. Um, and then we went out. So it's and just... You, you can't just have a few of the casual dinner, can you? Well, we just started slinging piss and I was no, like... You started slinging piss. I can guarantee you that everyone else would have had a, a casual four, maybe five drinks, and old Mr. Jake Edward Archdale over here would have had 15 plus. Well, yeah. Well, Pestily do- doesn't drink. Fasfi, she, not a big drinker, so they were both sort of not drinking. Mm-hmm. These are the guys. Um, Mac, uh, he was kind of sort of... Have okay. a little rip in. Josh, the bloke that sort of organised the whole thing, he was sort of half keen. Berticus, mm-hmm. who's Brit, she um, she started ripping. She had a good nudge. and But I think I was driving a fair bit of it. Yeah. And you're, then, a, you're an enabler. Yeah. Yes, I'm well aware. I've been out with you multiple times and you, are the, you are the problem. Yeah. <laughs> You can get fucked. You are the problem. Yeah. Take a look in the mirror. <laughs> Have a look at yourself and reflect. Um, reflect on the big George Foreman grill. I will. <laughs> I will. But they were – so we, we ended up going and having a great time. Now, mate, so I 
as I do, I like to smoke bomb. Oh, yeah. So it's I guess not the, great when you were strangers as well, you idiot. But my brain was so drunk that it didn't even, I don't care. So everyone's going, oh, my God, we've lost Jarch in Bangkok. The, literally. I, I, like, when I got on my watch. Hey, 101, what? grow up. That if there's one learning curve for 2024, <sighs> stop smoke bombing. Never. I'll never change. Just tell people nope. you leave it. No. Nope. What, what's going through your mind? What's your no logic? No idea. My brain but just goes me wrong, over I, it, done. I do a smoky every now and then. So, but like, miss me with that shit then. No, because yours is like every fucking time. Well, and it's in your bloody wheelhouse and I wish it wasn't. Yeah, it is. And you know what? People just have to <laughs> learn to love me for that fact because I'm no, never going to change. No, I, I won't. Well, I'm never going to change them. Well, I will not love you for your flaws. And that is doth. Well, that's doth hurtful. Doth, doth but the truth. I doth accept. Well, anyway. I, I don't have any flaws, so. Continue Doth story You used to break them When you were eight When you just walk on them The floor Yeah Fuck. It's very good for two hours Thank sleep. you I'm, I, It's look, almost I'm, excellent I'm happy with it So I fuck off from the club We're at this bloody hip hop club Hip hop club the, the bass That's your worst fucking nightmare Dude the bass was so hectic That it's like oh. it, It's rearranged some of my internal that organs That sounds like a bit of LDD It was fu- it was fine But it was a bit fucked Because we couldn't talk and stuff You know what I mean But anyway I leave the club Leave the club Get a tuk tuk mm-hmm. I say brass I'm going to the Le Meridian Hotel He's like show us a look Anyway takes my phone Google Maps Chucks it in I'm in this fucking, so I'm going, sweet, and I'm blind, and I'm in this mm. tuk-tuk. We're swinging down the highway. I'm outside this thing like, woohoo! They're so fun. Having fun. I remember being in them when I went to Thailand. But I was so pissed that I was like, didn't realise I'd been in this thing for half an hour. And then I'm like, fuck, this has actually taken a long time to get back to the hotel. This is only 10 minutes away. I've been in it for half an hour. We turn off the highway into the slums. Pitch black. No one about. It's like th- fucking 2 o'clock in the morning, what, what, one thirty in the morning. And I'm like, what the fuck is going on? And then, like, he stops at this petrol station. There's, like, 20 street dogs. They start surrounding the fucking tuk-tuk. And I'm like, and I'm going, get the fuck out, you fucking mongrels. Go, get out. And he's like, don't, don't do that. Don't do that. I'm like, no, nah, get, what the, where, where, what, what are we doing, bros? He's like, we're, we're nearly there. And I'm like, this is weird. This is getting weird. And I'm like, fuck, am I about to be fucking killed here? Oh, uh, yeah. And then we start going in this, like, gated community. We're going through checkpoints and shit. I'm going, something's off. Pull up to the Le Meridian. And it is Le Meridian, but it's a different one out near the airport. It, he has taken me to the wrong one. Instead of 10 minutes away. But I was so fucking blind on my brush. This is not the right one. And he's like, what? And so I get my phone off the front of the thing and I'm like, it's this one. It's this one. Blah, blah, blah. Give it back to him. Another hour to get home. Dude. And by this stage, you know, like, and he kept stopping at petrol stations and like having fights with the people like yelling at each other in the straight in dogs. fucking Thai Thai <coughs> Thai right that's the language I think, I think so. so right I don't know. yeah it's just Thai I think yeah yeah so they're just screaming at each other and I'm going the fuck is going on here like this is fucking edge eventually get Did, to a was your tuk tuk one of the ones where you play your own music and it's got like lights and flashing <coughs> had lights and shit but I wasn't playing my own oh music oh my god when Millie and I went out in ours we were just honing around playing music like full lights going it was like a club we were playing Bieber yeah he was again. It was he amazing. started playing music when we got back into the city right and I was kind of like shut did you go down that big strip oh no you, we were probably in different places. I was, well, where was I? Phuket. Yeah. Yeah, no, I was in. How far away are Phuket and Bangkok? F- a flight away, different. Oh, that's a yeah, shame. Yeah, yeah. So we fucking, he's driving, eventually he fills up with petrol at the petrol station like they've accepted him to do it. And he's driving me back and I'm like, fuck. So I, when I got to the first one, I just gave him like 5,000 baht, which is like fucking a few hundred bucks. Mm-hmm. I said, just get me the fuck home, bruss. <clears throat> Get back there, he's like, another 4,000. When he eventually gets to the thing, it's like three in the morning. I've checked WhatsApp and Brit was like, where the fuck is Jack? Does anyone know where he is? And I wrote back, I'm like, I'm just back at the hotel. Like, I'm all good. I'll spin the yarn tomorrow. And he's like, another 4,000. So you've done like a two and a half hour round trip. Bro, it was like three hours. And I'm like, not a chance, mate. And he goes, another 4,000. I said, fuck off, cunt. No way. You fuck off. And he's like, okay. Like, just try to, <laughs> try to stitch oh, me Oh, I would have absolutely folded. Yeah, but I, well, I didn't have, I had no more money. So well, I was like, not a chance. spent it all on grogs, hadn't you? I had. Do you want to know something that um, about Thailand? Well, I've been, but please, Doth, let's continue. So Brittany Allen, she's a, she's a quite a well-renowned streamer. 
um, and Gamer, she was there. Mm. She was spinning this yarn that over in Thailand, this is fair dinkum, over in Thailand, people go over there to get surgeries and stuff. Yeah. Like, because it's cheaper. I met a Veneers, bloke on the way over named boobs. Pup. Yeah, yeah, who was getting fucking teeth and nose done. Fake tits. Apparently, there's a market for nipples. Apparently, in Tha- people have gone over to Thailand to get their boobs done. They come back to Australia or whatever, take the bandages off and everything. Nippless. No more nips. They remove the nipples during the procedure and sell them. You can sell your nips. I'd Wait, take 10 but, grand a nip. Mine are tiny. But but they haven't asked for their nips. No, 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 no. No, they have not, Louisa. That's surely illegal, yeah, Yes, Yes, Louisa, it is. But apparently there's a healthy illegal black uh, nipple well, don't market. Don't people go over to, um, is it, I want to say Spain or Greece to get their hair transplant? Turkey. Turkey. Yeah. And they get a luscious afro of hair. Yeah. Not the same. No, the same. no, it's not the same. It's, I'm talking about people yeah. removing someone's nipples. Well, I would be yeah. devastated if I went to get a boob job and my nips were gone. Dude. Who's I reckon, selling nips? I reckon I'd flip my nips. Why are you buying nips, though? What are you using the nips for? I, I, Where are Dior? you putting the nips? You got anything on the legal nipple market? Anyone, I mean, yeah, anyone it's a selling bit of a thing. nips? Like, it's, it's been written up. There's the, lots of black markets and stuff. Black blips, black market for nips, blips. Yeah. Well, I mean, there is a black market for anything. Yeah. You could you could sell anything on the net. <laughs> Correct. Correct. Well, you could. You could sell nets. What? Oh, yes. You know? Said so. The other thing. Yes. So. Um, but yeah, how wild is that? Mm. So you can fucking sell, you, they just wow. take your nipples. Wow, thanks. I'll I'll go. I'll keep that in the back of my brain. Just in case you wanted to go Just there and get a boob job in Thailand, nah, prepare to be nippless when you get I'm home. I'm content. There's a there's a, a post that talks about the notorious nipple gang. Oh, what? And and yeah, I think they steal people's nipples. <laughs> okay, so they're the. Oh dear! Instead of the ham burglar, it's the nip burglar. She's good. <laughs> I'm happy with it. You got one. Um, um, well, you'd be upset if you just wanted to nip in and nip out for a quick nip and tuck, and then you and then you leave nipless. Fuck! So it became a poem in the end. I um, <laughs> it would be like a prehistoric nipposaurus. Mm, not Above sure. average? No. It's not Dior's penis. <laughs> oh, uh, <laughs> who's average? <laughs> yeah, who, You're above average. Who said? Who said we were having Doritos? We're not having chips. We're having nips. Okay, all right. You getting there? Oh, I don't, I'm not tired. I just want nips. You gonna kip? <laughs> yeah. yeah. Should have said I just wanted a a, nip. a quick nip. I basically did. Yeah, okay, I'll pay it. Well, you've got nothing, so I could just keep going. Dude, I just did four in one. No, you did one, one doth of poem. Um, mate, do you mind if I have, <clears throat> what will I have in terms of ice cream? I'll have Napolitina. <laughs> yeah, just three nips. I'll have the Napolitina. One, two, three. Jockey, strawberry, vanilla, <laughs> nips. <laughs> Speaking of Neapolitan... <laughs> Oh, is it Neapolitan? Yeah, what Nipopolitan. Why don't I say Napolitana? It's um, it used to be a good f- a good choice of ice cream. Wouldn't wouldn't go near it. I'm now. with you. You know what's phenomenal? Hokey pokey, your what? classic hokey poke. So what's hokey pokey? Is it in New Zealand? Honeycomb? No, it's yeah, not. Honeycomb. It's it's in it's, it's vanilla here. with honeycomb. Yeah, gotcha. You get a good quality hokey poke. You're you're going to town. Kids eat. Yeah, 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 yeah. Kids eat. Kids eat for free. Yeah. yeah. Oh, and goody goody gumdrops. Well, no, I don't know about that. It's a New Zealand one again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But but just go to Messina and get Super Dolce or go to Anita's and get Cookie Man. Oh, yeah, big chance of cooking that. Hold on. Oh, oh, goody goody gumdrops is bubblegum flavoured? Mm-hmm. Don't know if I can get around that. I used to get around bubblegum flavoured uh, fucking ice cream. Yeah. Well, I can still eat it while I'm young because you know it's my birthday soon. <clears throat> yeah. So next Monday, by the way, uh, the twentieth of November. Uh, so, yeah, we're all pumped. I don't know if you guys have planned anything for. We obviously won't be recording that day, but we will the next day. So just an FYI, the twenty first 
if I have the Tuesday when we record the podcast, like maybe. Yeah, no, we've got we've got something crazy planned. <coughs> you we you boys? won't have. No, we have, man. It's you'll be like, what? No, what? you haven't thought of anything. No, you'll be going like this. What the God, heck? you what the you guys are cra- you guys are mad for that. And then we'll go. Told you, um, I told we we all told you. It feels like a lie. It's not. It's so true. Mm-hmm. We're just telling you the truth. Hey Siri, put reminder to plan something for Lou's birthday. No, seriously. Do, do that. Oh, my reminder just came up, but I don't need to plan something for myself. So what what are you doing for your birthday? Well, Jill and Franco get here on Janko, yeah. Friday. Franco gets here on Friday. Jill gets here on Saturday. Yep. Um, Saturday night probably just chill. Sunday going out for a long lunch to celebrate the old three zero. <laughs> <laughs> yep. And then Monday the actual birthday. Fuck your old. Sorry. Excuse Sorry. Me, no, I'm shut so, your mouth I'm when you're so, speaking to me. I, that is much better. I'm so sorry about that. Yeah, you fucking should be. It's just ridiculous. AJ ain't nothing but a number, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so you get long lunch. Um, and then the Did Monday, I get a bait to that or? You you can come if you'd like. So the answer's no. <laughs> you can. No, the answer's We're simply no. Dior, you going to long lunch? It's Yeah, just you didn't get the invite? Tubbs. Oh, shit. You swing into the longy? Sorry, Judge. <laughs> Yeah, I did. I'm just joking with everyone. <laughs> Shit. Add one more. Add one more seat. Nah, that one's just with fam. And then the weekend after, we party, bitch. Oh, God. You've Ooh, been I'm really been lame today. Icky. It's not good, is it, buddy? So, do and will I be saying some words? Yes, please. But how, for how long? Just a quick minute or two. Oh, okay. You don't want me to do it for fucking... Oh, I don't want a seven minute or... Yeah. That's too long. Okay, a minute or two. Lose everyone's attention. Two minutes is fine. Cute. I'll hold that room. I know. I would. Li- I would also like you to do a song or a rap. You yeah. can pick doing uh, nerdy bra, perhaps. Well, I don't know about that. I'll do a speech. Okay. That speech. Maybe is I'll good. do nerdy bra. You could do it. I could. A few tiki sodas in me, and everyone starts chanting. You know yeah, who's yeah. up on the. Yeah. You know who's up on the. You'll stage? be up on the table. Mummy. Yeah, and your mummy, by mummy. the way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thanks Just for clarification. Thank you for clarifying that. <coughs> well, it's exciting, Lulu. I know. Big birthday girl. Well, birthday. I haven't, to be honest, let's be real. I oh. haven't been that much of a diva. No, you haven't. I've barely spoke. I think I've brought well, up twice on the pod. No, nah, you, but you've, you've sp- you speak about it a lot in civilian life. L- disagree. I've had two bedwitters message me saying, what's the address sending you something? <laughs> <laughs> Is anything arrived, Dior? No. You're mm. a grub. It's not a grub. It's cute and kind that people wouldn't send a little gift. I send gifts to people. Send me gifts. Oh, wait. Maybe all those chocolates and sweets and stuff. We thought oh. they were for us. They're finished already. And, Liar. And those gold bracelets and that. Yeah, oh, yeah. That we sold all that jewelry, on the black market. Yeah. Liar. I said you get a free nip with every gold bracelet. Mm. Someone sent a live koala as a pet. And oh, that's just right. Yeah. And we sent that to the farms. <laughs> Well, you can't keep a live koala. Well, you can. I've got one in Rose Bay. His name's Kevin. (laughs) We have a... There's a cleaner who goes around like all my friends and his name's Kevin. And Tor texts me being like, fucking Kevin hasn't arrived on time. And I sent her a photo of my Kevin and said, he's still asleep. Oh, God. (laughs) Fuck me, dude. You're you're a worry. Uh, I don't think, honestly, in my head, I don't feel 30. I think I age... I think I'm around 24, 25. Mate, I I truly believe that AJ, nothing but a number, baby. You've got to stop. Baby. You've AJ, nothing but a number, sister. AJ, nothing but a number. you got to stop. Uh, yeah. Check mic one, two. Uh. Dior's even looking icky and I thrusted. Oh. Uh, God. Oh. Sorry. You're Sorry, a everyone. you dickhead. Yeah, <laughs> I'm disgusted in myself. You should be. I should be. You've piece. I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell Frill not to bother coming over. Who? Frill, Frank and Jill. <laughs> Duh. <laughs> I need to stop laughing so hard on the podcast and Nick p- tilting my head backwards because. Um, no. <laughs> what? I wasn't going to say what. Just tell me why. Because I get this really bad double chin when I put my head Triple. up. 
like that. Triple. Triple chin. Yeah. yeah this is triple chin. It's not double. Oh, triple. <laughs> Sorry, qu- quadruple. Sometimes I just want to reach over, grab one, and just bung it on my face. Yeah, well, fuck. We could get surgery. We could go to Turkey and do that. Yeah, true. Or Thailand. True. Hopefully come back with four naps. Fabs. Two do- of mine, two of yours. Yeah, correct. Mummy and daddy's naps. Can I tell you a little yarn about what happened on the plane flight over? Yeah. Fuck it. Fuck it, shit me to tears. What? There was this family of English, English people. Fucking, the dad was sitting in front of me, the mum, little brother, older brother. The older brother and the dad on opposite ends, we were in the middle of the plane, that four seat middle bit, you know yeah. what I mean? They start drinking. Yeah. Drinking pretty heavy. They get pissed. I was sitting next to these three birds and I had these big noise cancelling headphones on, sort oh, of, nice. you know, listening shit. And these birds kept like looking over and whatever and I could see them like standing up and whatever. And I'm like, um, what's going on? So I just lift the headphones up. Have a little, have a little listen. Have a little listen. Little gaze. You know, little gaze. And it's just like, it's just like um, the the son going, you don't talk about my mother like that. She's fucking beautiful. She's a beautiful lady. You don't talk about mum. And he goes, oh yeah, you tell me what the fucking think, son, don't you? Or you fucking tell me what the fucking think, son. Right, when I get to fucking Thailand, I'm losing a lot of you. I'm out by myself. Fuck the lot of you. Having a full stink. And I'm like, oh, God, fucking dickheads. How old is the other? The dad would have been fucking 55 odd. Son would have been 20 odd, you know, 22 odd. And um, so I go back. Mate, they were at it for fair income two hours. Did the flight attendants come over and Yeah, go, they banned them. They, they had to. One of the birds next to me fucking got the flight and said, listen, these people have been fucking going at it and i'm not joking like then they had like would like swap seats i thought they were going to punch on at some point the they'd like swap seats yeah would swap seats he's like you sit over there yeah i fucking will sit here mate yeah That's i wh- fucking will sit here mate yeah <laughs> not bad <laughs> and, and then this and then all then, right geezer well sorry that's right and then the son was like, you know, I love you, Dad. You know, I fucking love you. Yeah, I love you too, son, but what you're doing is out of fucking line, mate. You and know I'm just you like, shut your, your fucking mouths, you mutts. You sound identical to the, um, who's that coach on that movie? Is it Bendit like Beckham and oh, he's no. bald? Oh, um, no, Denzel Washington from Remember the Titans. No. Okay. You know the one. <laughs> no, is it in She's the Man? Yes. The bald guy in She's the Man. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. yes, and he's going... All right, you fucking geezers. <laughs> you got to fucking kick the fucking ball. I don't think, I don't think he's calling that uh, the lady, what, Amanda Bynes, mm. a fucking geezer. And well, she's the man. Right, you little fucking geezer. Yeah, correct, right, kick correct. the fucking ball. Now you're going a bit Alfie. Uh, no. You were turning uh, about no, Alfie. Alf. Tell me. Right, fucking, oh, I haven't done this for a while. Right, little fucking Alfie. Right. so good at it. Just kick the fucking ball. Kick, All right, kick the, the fucking ball, fucking Linda. Net. Amanda, you're gonna lose this soon, mate. You're gonna go fucking nuts, aren't you? You're gonna go fucking nuts, aren't you? Well, I but, am a good pezza. Parrot. No, <laughs> it's a parrot. <laughs> no, Judge. No. no, you're not a good pezza. I think I am. She's taking a selfie. Uh, should we do? What are we doing this episode? Hinges. You want some hinges? Yeah, I really would, mate. Because I'm fucking tired. Right, fucking tired. Right, need a bit fucking in gym in life. Right. Sorry. Let me Why just are you taking selfies? Dude, for someone who's mid, you take a lot of selfies. Mid? <laughs> What's that mean? <laughs> <laughs> What's mid? Does that mean it's like- a wrecking. M- isn't like mid to year hotness. <laughs> You're top tier. I'm just joking. That'd be hurt. Mate, you're a fucking, what did I call you, like a nine? Oh. Yeah, I'll take that, actually. Yeah, I'll go. fucking take that, all right? All right, Tommy, show me. I'll fucking. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. Give me that fucking gun, Linda. All right. Call her a fucking nine. All right. Call her a fucking nine. All right, Louisa. Right, sitting over there. Right, little Louisa. Sounds better in headphones, don't it? Oh, let me. Right. Who doth have put my ears to Grab her gun, grab fucking Linda, fucking shoots her. Oh, God. Shoots her. You know what you should do, Judge? You should start an audible book. <laughs> People seem to love your voice. 
Yeah, okay. I'll just start an audible book. Should read The Hungry, Hungry Caterpillar. <laughs> a hungry, hungry caterpillar. Hey, who knocked on the door earlier? Oh, it was a present for Lou. Oh. <laughs> Don't do you want it. Did you want it? Don't. My eyes just lit up. Is it actually? Oh, You're joking. Oh, dude, look at her. She had to shit herself. No, it's this. <laughs> that is brilliant. <laughs> that's, that's so oh. mean, Dior. You see stupid. my face? I went because it says Jesse, and I was like, "What? <laughs> my name's not Jesse." Genius. Dior, that's very oh, cruel. Sorry, that is fucking. Uh, well, don't throw Jesse's fragile. Sorry, Jesse. <laughs> That was great, bruh. Grumpy Lou. You're a fucking you animal. You brought that on yourself, Lou. You were too keen on yeah. the Prezi. It was very evil. Bro, her eyes lit up like there was not Oh, buddy. It, no. Oh, dear. Is that, am I connected, Dior? <laughs> no, it doesn't say Well, I'm not actually speaking to you, Dior. <laughs> <laughs> Josh, could you please ask Dior if we're connected? Dior, we're connected? Josh, can you tell Lou that she's not connected? Sh- so, Louisa, you're not connected. Okay. Josh, could you please ask Dior if I'm now connected? I've clicked it again. So Dior, it's, it's I've heard that she's working. clicked it again, and she's is she, is she now connected? She's now not connected. So should I tell? Should I relay that? Yeah, you should. So Louisa, she, you're, you're now you're still not connected. Okay. You nothing, might. nothing to report back to Dior just yet. Dior, please just confirm. There's nothing to report back to you as we speak. You can tell Lou she might need to forget it and find it again. You might well, need to forget it and find it. You can tell again. Dior I might need to forget him. Oh no, you can tell Lou. <laughs> so you, she might need to forget you. It is what she. <laughs> you see. can tell Lou she's now connected. She, you're so Lou, you're connected now. Thanks, thanks, Judge. The Dior, only- she just thanked. She yeah, thanked me. <laughs> Everyone's gonna go on the DM. <laughs> tough listen. <laughs> Real uh, tough listen. Okay, silence. Hinge when J notes. Hinge when J notes. Jachi wants his hinge when J notes. Nice. Okay. On the floor. This guy has said, "Don't show this to my mum." Oh well, if it would bloody work. It's just a photo of his. Don't show. Oh. <laughs> You've been very inappropriate today, aren't you? I'm fucking walking off two hours sleep. Yeah, we get it, mate. You drink, you're a champion. You've been oh, overseas and tired. Don't you? Yeah, big dog, big dog, <laughs> Josh been overseas. He plays Calls of Duty, guys. Calls of Duty. <laughs> <laughs> oh. All right, shut up or you won't get your hinges. Sorry. Don't show me to your mum because I might like your mum better than I like you, so that would be awkward at family dinners and stuff. Imagine, imagine me dating someone and then ending No, it. I couldn't. Wrecked. 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 Are you okay? Okay, please continue with the and, train of thought. And then me going, hey, not quite for me. And I come home one day and mum's like, I've got to introduce you to someone. And I've it's the guy I've got with before. How itch would that be? What? Happens in movies. <laughs> Correct. Wouldn't be great, would it? I mean, it would be top ten worst things that could happen. I... Disagree They're with like, that. Yeah, maybe not top ten. Like imagine, like if I can name like someone like slicing your leg from your knee to your hip is worse than that, and then revealing well, all the you meat. Can get that stitched up. This is more like a mental. No, thing. And then peeling the skin back. Okay, I can imagine getting hit by a train would be yes. probably worse than that. Okay. Um, someone pulling out all your teeth one by one, yeah, and then doing a wee on your face. Yeah, well, worse than that. Not for the bed where it is, but... Well, it's correct. Mm-hmm. Um, having to do a podcast with, like... Um, mm. s- no, someone you don't get along with would be worse than that. Well, that wouldn't be us, wouldn't it? Well, wouldn't you? Wouldn't you be very sad if someone else was in the seat? <laughs> yes, you? correct. You're right, aren't you? Yes. Who's yeah. very clever? <laughs> Me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very clever, aren't I? You're very clever, aren't you? Keep your foot. Okay, this guy said, a friend's review of me... Hello, my name is Barack Obama, the 44th President of the United States of America. Here is why I think you should consider Liam as a dating option. Potentially, Liam was right by my side throughout the entire election campaign, Joe Biden who. I started Obamacare, but it was Liam who came up with the whole idea because he cares the most. 
Just like how I stopped Bin Laden, Liam can help you stop being single and trump all your friends. A correct choice here is as good as a vote for Obama. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a date with the basketball court. Would that be AI? Would that be Al? Yes. Like, obviously, it's not Obama, but like, or would that be a professional actor? Think about it. Think about it. Did you hear I pronounce some of the words? It's, it's like Clearly Siri. Al. It was AI. Yes, it's Al. Yeah. It's Alistair. Alistair, the actor. Yeah, it's Alistair. It's Alistair. I, can I give some critical feedback on that one? Sure. I'll pass it on to Liam. A great concept doing that. Could have made it way funnier. You can have Obama saying anything. You're talking about fucking well, Obama. Well, Judge, like I said, humor is subjective. <laughs> yeah, correct. So, Hence why we're subjectively allowed to provide our yeah, own well, feedback. Well, Leah might have thought that was hilarious, and ten other girls may have, and then six others may have not have doth found funny. It's a doth good point. You're a doth genius. Thank you. It's very kind. Thank you. It's very kind. It's very kind. Bind. It's good. Yeah, we'll, we'll roll with it. I think. This guy said, "Dating me is like." Hey, I'm Jesse. Welcome to my Hinge profile. Enjoy a taste of ambient jazz while you scroll. I'm new here and thinking maybe you're the one to get me off. <clears throat> well, like off the app, I mean. I like puppies, killing spiders. <laughs> Helping old women with their groceries. If you feel like you're in love, it's normal. There's a lot to unpack here. Well, let's, let's please, please proceed. So he was obviously referring to wanking. Well, he'd like them to get him off the app. Sorry. So, well, she could be absolutely, but. Yes. <clears throat> Is there anything else you'd like to dissect? A frog. It's very helpful helping old women with their groceries. Yeah. Do, do you reckon spot. that actually happens? I could, to be honest. Yeah, I've this done is that. A com- I was like, this is a compliment to you. I could see you pulling over your tig you aren't and helping <coughs> someone. Not yeah, me. You'd probably like throw my groceries on the floor and stomp on them. No, but an Louisa, old woman. Louisa. Jack. I've helped old women with their groceries, of course. Yeah, I could see you doing that. You're very, you're very kind, aren't you? But see, that shouldn't be something that should be considered kind, you know no, what I mean? It, but some people wouldn't do it. It's yeah. very sweet of you. Yeah. I, yeah, I don't know. You sweet little prince of uh, all clothes. Well, but I'm, I'll start blushing in 35 seconds if you're not careful over there, Aww. you brown angel of the northern lights. Now, <laughs> listen up. Do you or you'd help an old woman with her groceries? Yeah, I actually offered a woman the other day when I was sitting in the park because I locked myself out of the house, but she said no. Oh, true. Aww. Tobbs, Tobbs wouldn't. He's He actively seeks them out to violently assault them. It's something we've had to talk about. And it's not good. It's Tobler not a good. Tobler is gr- the sweetest prince of Correct. Tobler, Alexandria. Well, he Tob- offers to help them with their groceries and then he just runs away with the groceries. <laughs> he hasn't shopped for himself in like 10 years. It's like his own milk run. <laughs> Kids, yeah, correct. <laughs> Nana run. Okay. It's not um, great. It's not great, but we'll roll with it. Okay, this guy said, we'll get along if... Honestly, as long as you don't do crack, I think we'll get along. You know, now that I think of it, I don't think I've talked to anyone who's done crack. It's a more... It felt unnecessary for a voice note. What's, I don't think it needed. What's wrong with crack? Suddenly there's all this... Negative press around crack. Up, judge. You know what I mean? I don't think it needed to be a voice note. <clears throat> Maybe save that conversation for the date. If it's something you feel you must bring up. Yeah, you get there, the entrees are coming. It's like, so, Jennifer, you a little uh, crackhead? Or not? No? Not a crack hole? <laughs> Perfect. This is going to go swimmingly. They were eating scallops. To me, it felt like they were um, indulging in a steak. It was the entree. The it was an entree. It was more like a salt and pepper squid situation, I think. Well, I feel like you'd probably potentially pick that up with your fingers. Not Liam. <laughs> That's not his name, but sure. <laughs> okay. okay. Uh, this guy said, my self-care routine is? It's a moisturizer and then a cleanser for the skin and then for the beard, pussy juice. I didn't know I'd left a voice note. (laughs) (laughs) 
Yeah, it's good stuff. I'm pretty sure we've had that one before. Oh, Have I'm we? So Maybe sorry. I don't know. I think I'm we've had so something sorry. similar, but I don't know if we've well, had that. Well, can I say, uh, I obviously go for a scroll and try and find them myself, but a lot of people send them to me, so yeah. it's hard to know what you've doth have had and what you haven't. And because, Jarch, in uh, Breakfast Radio, we would have a spreadsheet where if you were to you know, do a, a type of segment, you would put what you had already done down so it was not doth have repeated. Oh, but on, we on. don't have that. Hold on. Sorry, have I uh, gone backwards, too far backwards. on this let's take, let's take a break here. Okay. A backward step. Sorry, yeah. <laughs> You, let me just clarify something. You used to work in Breakfast Radio. Yes. What? Yeah. Yeah, oh. I did. For, for who, anyone I'd know? Fitzy and Whipper. Fitzy and Whipper. Yeah. I do. I've heard of them. You've heard of Nova, 96.9. I've heard of Nova. Yeah. That, I, I was one of the producers. <laughs> you are joking. Yeah. No, I'm very clever. No, who is a clever girl? I, I believe it would be me, the no, 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 seriously, who is a clever girl? It's me. It, no, you, you are. I, I know I am. You are clever. Incredibly clever. <laughs> you're a clever girl. You are a clever boy. No, you're fucking clever. No, you, you're fucking clever. No, mate. No, don't, mate. You're clever. You're fucking clever, mate. You're, you're fucking clever. <laughs> you're fucking clever, mate. Um, I don't know. What? Well, we're done with hinges now. They were good. Thank you. All right, you fucking hot pieces of shit. Sorry. I'm just going to clap for Dior, but don't worry about it. Yeah, I think he's brilliant as well. We love you, Dior. <laughs> oh, thank we you. Love love you. Love oh, yes. of, we love you, our sweet little prince of... He's our sweet little prince. Ah, Camperdown. Camperdown. Yeah. But you were in Kins Kenford. Kids Kingsford. Kenford, yeah. King, Ken, Ken King. All right, you done with your texting? Nearly. Okay. Uh, now I am, you Dotheth good. Jake. Got to respect it, Laura. <laughs> okay, you Look fucking... Look at that little raccoon. That is not a raccoon, oh. buddy. That seems like it's some sort of a fox? an Alaskan fox. Fantastic, Mr. Fox. Da -dum, da -dum. That's the Pink Panther theme tune. You just get shit fucking wrong all the fucking time, don't you, mate? <laughs> all right, I've done zero prep. Oh, I am absolutely <laughs> shocked at that, Jack. <laughs> I just, you are usually... So fantastic at prep. Okay, great. Now he's put his Crocs on, on my leg. Okay, yep. Is that covered my beautiful face, Dior? No, no, no. We can still see your Thank beautiful God. face. But Cut. unfortunately, the I'm not wearing shoes are though. Distracted by Jarch's <laughs> even more beautiful feet. Well, disagree. I'm wearing my gorgeous friend Reby's um, two-piece set. She's Oi, very clever, isn't she? What I've noticed. A lot of comments, funny comments, people going... Lou, where's your top from? No, yeah, but also going, love that these two always show up like they're going completely different places. Oh, You'll be dressed in like brilliant clothes, looking beautiful, and I'm like in this bullshit, and they're like... People say we're like um, Hayley and Justin Bieber because she is like dressed to the nines, <laughs> and then he rocks up in like a fucking tracksuit, and they're going to like a gala. <laughs> I'm just... A piece of shit. Yeah. Let's be real. <laughs> All right, bad wetters. Let's see what you mongrels have <coughs> got for us, eh? You sweet. G'day, bed wetting cunt. <laughs> um, it's Bella here. Bella from the other episode. Um, I just wanted to say, Lou, I just saw your Instagram story about is it too early for Christmas decorations? And anyone that fucking says it is can actually be the Grinch. But I mean, the Grinch is literally just someone who wants to be alone with his dog and who doesn't want that. So, you know, he just hates people realistically. But, um, True. yeah, my house is fully fucking decked out. I don't know who doesn't want to do that. But um, It's nice. Yeah, keep on pissing, you bed wet and cunts. Hey. You, you know what's interesting? I fully agree with her, but last episode, I fully contradicted myself. I said, I usually put up, which is rare This is us. what we do. Um, I said, I usually put up my Chrissy decorations after my my, you know, my birthday soon, Jack, the 20th of November. I usually put my Christmas decorations up after that, but I thought, fuck it. They arrived and I chucked them on up. I haven't got a tree. I've just got some cute chic decor. Oh, Mama's, Mama's, decor. Mama's put in some Chris, the Chrissy deckies. Yeah, and I got this little Christmas tree thing with these colourful trees and they sort of, you know, like go, they're a bit sort of like funky and yeah. everyone was replying saying they look like floppy dicks. So Oh, oh I saw perfect. that on your story. That's perfect. <coughs> I've got dicks all splattered around my house. Nothing's changed. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, wake up You're not going to sleep I'm no Jeff Alright Yes, from the Wiggles, so sorry
Oh, that was, that a was ripper. beautiful. That was a ripper call. That was phenomenal. Yeah, that was. Oh. Like, what I liked is how in depth they went. And it's very just, motivational, that, wasn't it? I feel inspired. But what is if you aren't jumping out of bed or yeah. jumping out of the cage, you know, after that sort of a yarn, that, that motivation is unparalleled. And that's the best. That is the best hotline I think we've ever had. Mm. Star that, and we'll get it made into memorabilia. <laughs> That's going to be our first audio book on Audible. Yes. Okay. She's with me. All right, you fucking hot things. Let's see what we got. Hey, hey guys. Um, I was just thought about something from an earlier podcast. Uh-oh. You, you guys are talking about stacking donuts on your big fat juicy hogs. <laughs> um, I forgot about this. I was like, Mr. McCat, he seems more like a... Like, he need fucking <laughs> burger rings and donuts. Right. From what I've heard from you, Jarchi. <laughs> it sounds like Piglet. It's getting very Piggy vibes. It sounds like Piglet, but I don't Guys, think it is. I'm, I'm going to have to jump in here for a moment. Oh, Off yeah. speakerphone. Ripping on. 45 seconds. Phone up to the ear. Pull your fucking car over. Excuse- so sorry. Laura. So you sorry, do Jake. not scream at the bedwetters. So like- sorry, Jake. I love you, bedwetters. But seriously, <laughs> come on. We know better than that. Well, this one is 44 seconds, so they're right I'll under the mic. It. Okay. Hello, Jake and Laura. <laughs> I just had a thought after, or while listening to the um, episode 104, I'm pretty sure it is. Hi, boys. Um, what cracks me up? is that whenever Lou does an impression or a voice or character, normally it's just her own voice in a high-pitched tone. <laughs> That's so true. And I think she can do better okay. so fucking than true. just make her voice higher. Thank you for the motivation. But, you know, each to their own. If she thinks she's doing a good job, good on you, Lou. Bless your sweet soul. It, it, Let's prank him. Hey, oh. Let's get him. Let's get him, Josh. You're a genius. What am I doing? Have Probably we, just your voice, just high pitched, as he have said. Have we done the Chris, have we done the cake? No. You want a cake? Oh, in? No, I've done the cake, Teresa. Remember? Oh yeah, no, Talia. Okay, what am I doing? Um, oh, I've got it. I'm. I'm you got I'm it. Janine from E Toll. Is that what it's called? Link T. Linked. Linked. Isn't it just linked? Is it linked? I think it's linked T. Okay, linked. Linked. Hey, it's Janine from Link. It's just your voice higher. Oh, He's dead right. Fuck. He's dead fucking go, right. Give me a go. All right, let's do it. Hey, it's Janine from Link. <laughs> I'm going to go low. Don't be so aggressive. I'm going to go real low. I'm yeah, go. Okay. Oh, it's down. Janine from Link. Yeah. Um, basically. Sorry. Louder. <laughs> Look at the way you're fucking sitting. <laughs> you're a pig. Hi, it's Janine from Link here. The person you are calling is uh, not available. Please leave a short message and it will be sent as an audio message. Hey, it's Janine here from Linked. I'm just calling because you've got an overdue toll. <laughs> he didn't go lower. He went <laughs> higher. He went higher. Oh, it's, it's Jake and Laura here. No, it's Janine from Linked. Sorry, it's Janine from Linked. Um, and J- and J- you, you missed us. But here, here's a voice note for you. So, it's say la vie. Mate, you were dead fucking, you were dead on when you said that her, all her characters are just her voice with a higher pitch. Oh, I'm going to practice. Maybe I should get some lessons. Some accent lessons. Yeah, well, the singing lessons definitely work. Hey, so shut your w- sweet mouth, Prince of, sweet, sweet mouth. Prince of Bangkok. <laughs> Bye, love you. Okay, Bye. catch ya. Ciao, ciao. Bad boy to stay, keep hissing. Okay. That'll do us. That'll do us for today. Daddy's we a bit. We love you guys. Daddy's hey, worn out. Daddy's tired. Daddy wants to go sleepy. I'm Mummy daddy, also tired. Mummy been waking up at 2 a.m. wide awake lately. That, that don't, don't compare. No, don't I've been, try. honestly, it's almost as if like a ghost takes over my body and I boof, ba wide awake at 2 a.m. A ba Your white noise must stop. <laughs> oh my God. It, uh, no, it did actually abruptly stop the other night. Fuck. It was terrifying. Because it just goes. <laughs> I can't believe that. It was like. So fucking scary in the east. <laughs> like it was fucked up. It was like uh, really fucked up. 
You're a funny fuck, mate. Bless your sweet, sweet soul. Now, listen up, bedwetters. We're going to figure out how to vote on the Hottest 100, but it doesn't come out until December. I think, I think the voting opens for the fucking... First of December. Yeah. Let so. me do the talking. You just be quiet for now. Thanks, Mama. Jake's going to have a little snooze. I'm going to say thank you to all of you. We love you all so much. Mwah, mwah, kisses. And just a quick one. It is my birthday next <laughs> Monday, the 20th of November. I love you all so much. Mwah, hey, ciao, ciao. Hooray. Hey, Goodbye. You fucking scumbag. Give me free uh, stuff. Excuse me. Give me Cut free stuff. Give me free stuff. Cut a deal. No, I want free stuff. I want free stuff.